And let's do it, guys. All right, welcome to FMU. Coach Theo, Coach Angie, some people live. If you're jumping on the on the recording, good to see you. We got to do a lot of uh, shoulder prep to make sure we're warmed up. We got to do pretty fast warm up and then pretty fast paced five by five workout, five moves, five times. That's what makes it a mental game. So let's do this. Let's make sure we open up our shoulders and stretch them out big time. Um, and then let's walk through each move as more of a warm up. And then let's just get started. We're gonna let this timer dictate everything today. So it's gonna be one minute on, back to back to back to back to back. All right, I'm up in my weights today, so that one. <laughs> yes. I might need the rest. No, that's just sweet. I, uh, wait, go on the side now, open them up. I've been telling people that five pounds makes such a difference, right? I think if two pounds makes such a difference. And so actually, I'm glad you brought that up because in this workout, a lot of big strength moves with our heavy weights, we might look like we're moving slow. So if someone's got light weights, they might want to go fast. Don't necessarily follow our pace because we got to be really controlled with it, right? Look at it and then try to touch the ground with it. So this is great. Uh, and then switch sides because you have done this workout before. I've just, I've switched one, maybe two moves. That's all. But you've done the concept. And I remember actually you said, oh, no, that was, that was rough. So now that you're adding extra weights, you got a new element. And I love it. Keep going side to side with it. But you'll see the first move really sets the whole circuit up for torture. It's not that bad, I'm just saying that. Hey, do this now, hinge, and then pull it up. And then what you do is do a fly. So do a nice big walk, or high stretch, and then T stretch. A lot of pushing, but I also got two pulling moves. So very total body hybrid concept. And uh, I'll do a good mix of dumbbells and bands. But now that we're there, go ahead and just hinge and stretch. Come up with it. Oh man, what a crazy morning. No one will know though, because they didn't <laughs> see behind the scenes. It's just me and Angie in the house today. Our crew left us today. Everyone's on everyone? vacation. Oh. So there's three people on vacation this week, I know for sure. Okay, now we gotta do one leg like that. So one leg, because we got some coming up. So I'll walk you through this move. One leg hinge. We'll use dumbbells when we get there today. I think the other challenge today is that everything's a minute. And it's non-stop for 35 minutes. You know what though? I sent everyone the link that's on vacation. Yeah. So they could have jumped in. Switch sides, other side. I'm sure they're gonna do the recording. That's true. <laughs> and the Quins are in the house. I see them popping in there. I love seeing people pop in on live. And those of you that do the recording, it's awesome dedication. All right, I do want to take you down. I want to take you to all fours. I got to do one more shoulder, one hip, and then we're going to walk through all five moves. So pull it under here and then open it up, push to the sticking point. Work that side till I tell you to switch. Do you think back to Saturday? Actually, think back to Sunday and Monday. You didn't feel super sore like I did? I mean, I couldn't walk. The last week I did six workouts in a row. Other side, oh goodness. So, so you were loose. Yeah. You were keeping your body moving. Yeah, the one we did, if you guys did it on Saturday with us. Wow, my triceps, my quad. I can feel my triceps. That's great. And now do the fire hydrant. So you're going to open it up, kick it back. So open up the hip and then straighten the leg. Side, kick back. Keep your body really straight and rigid. Try not to move your hips. Whoops. 
Make sure you got a water bottle. If you need a towel or a mat, make sure you got it ready. Good, other side now. So if you're just jumping in, we got the five by five workout. Total body moves, dumbbells, bands, body weight, nonstop, five moves, back to back, five rounds, and then we'll play. Lots of abs at the end. Good time. Okay, so let's do this for more of a warm up. Let's walk through all five moves and just do a few reps each. Because it's gonna be so fast paced, then when we get to them, you'll already be ready to go. So I would say this, for the first move, just grab one dumbbell, just for a few reps, because we got squat Arnold presses. But uh, when we do the Arnold, I'll show you how we uh, rotate our hands. But for right now, just do a squat and then a press. Just so we get more warmed up with the legs and the shoulders that are about to come. This first move of the circuit, is really going to set up the entire circuit. It's going to make you breathe pretty heavy, and it's total body, so it's going to get all your muscles right off the bat. That's good right there. The second move will do balance with a high pull. So we'll probably start with two dumbbells, but if you need to switch to one, you will. So you'll go single leg, hip hinge, and then high pull. So work a few on one side, I'll tell you when to switch. It'll be balance, stretch, and then go. If you ever need the back foot, you just put it on the ground. Because we don't want you to wobble a lot, other side. So if it's starting to mess you up, you just kind of drag the back foot when you go. If you have something to hold on to for balance, like a wall or a pole, you can do that. Takes a lot of control. So we'll be ready when we get there. Now drop that, that's good. The third move is hard because you're gonna have to catch your breathing while you put this band behind your back. And if you don't have it, you just won't use it. Then we hold a push up position, so get there. Level one is you do a walk out, right? Step out, left. So you'll just move side to side with your feet. Level two will be add a push up, come back up, and then keep going. This one, people were moaning and groaning yesterday about it. That's good, because we won't be able to breathe, and we're gonna have to do that for a minute. All right, then we'll grab a dumbbell again, just one. We'll use two later. We'll go, uh, we'll go reverse lunge. We did split squats on Saturday, so we're gonna do a reverse lunge and then curl at the top. When we get here, we'll use two dumbbells. Today for the warm up, just getting you to know the moves. Switch sides, other side. Step back, curl at the top. Good, and then the final move will be the cardio blast before we get that one minute recovery. You'll decide if you use a band or a dumbbell for jumping jack press. So more presses, but cardio jack, or you might start stepping out, whether you're in the band or using the dumbbell. Hit a few more, and then we're ready. Two, one. That's good. Okay, I did that so you know the five moves that are about to come up. Plus, it got us breathing a little bit. All right, coach. Ready. I say we start heavy. Okay. Some of these are gonna get super challenging, and then we can always drop since we've got the weights. If you don't have you know, a lot of weights, you just got one set, that's perfect. Uh, also, I forgot to say, on the shoulder squat to press on the first one, if you like the band, because it feels better on the shoulders, you can always use your band. All right, guys, this clock is going to lead us. One minute on, 12 seconds off. So think, five moves straight. 
Then we'll take your break and then we'll do five rounds. You got it. All right, here we go. Let's grab our dumbbells. Going heavy. We're gonna go heavy. So the tempo for us is gonna be controlled. If you got light weights, you go fast. Now I want you to rack it right here. I want you to squat on the way up, rotate and press. Then back to the rack position, squat, rotate, press. I'll show from the side. Squat, rotate, press. Always back to palms facing you. Hips back, feet flat on that squat. This is a front loaded position. So watch your back. Halfway. Rotate and press. Breathe in, breathe out. So this is where, if you got heavy dumbbells, nice and controlled. Ten seconds to go. Five, four, three, two, one. Yeah. The second move is that single leg hinge. And actually, I'm going to do one. I think two's going to get rough. Single leg hinge, and then high four at the top. Ready? Go. You pick where you want to start. I'll tell you when we're halfway. You can also hear that whistle though too. We do opposite hand, helps balance. Single leg stretch, you have a slight bend in the knee. Slight bend in the knee, chest over the floor, but you don't have to go too far. Keep it high too. I go right to the shin and back up. Shin, pull with your hips, switch sides, squeeze your butt to get back up. So control down. Chest higher than you think. Athletic stance and go. And remember, if you're falling all over the place because your balance is off, use that back foot. Drag it or touch whenever you need to. We got three, two, one. All right, now it's the torture time. The how can you breathe while you have a band around your back Push up challenge. All right, ready? First, it's around your back. Second is hold it. Third is step right, step left. Fourth is, if you want to, add a push up. You can use your knees for the push ups. So if you have to, drop to the knees, hit it, then pop back up. If all you want to do is walk, walk. If you want to walk a few steps and then hit, that's fine too. Sprinkle them in halfway when you want to. Here we go. 15 on the clock. The band really makes you think about what you have to squeeze to hold that. Five, four. Three, last one, good. Oh, that really makes you think where you have to squeeze to hold that band up. All right, almost done with two dumbbells. Reverse lunge with the curl. Let's alternate legs too. Let's go right and then up. Let's go left and then up. So reverse lunge, alternate legs. Curl at the top. Halfway, here we go. Come on, good lunge, 15, 10. If you got the strength, we're going for two more, one more. Got it. Jumping jack press. You going with dumbbell or band? I'm dumbbell. dumbbell. I'm gonna start with the band. 
for the first round. Ready, you're on. And then I'll see what happens. Oh, got it. The cardio blast before we get that minute break. Halfway, way to move. Ah, 15, keep that body moving. I'm coming. Bed is heavy. Six. Three. Two. One. Okay. One minute break. Okay. I'm glad I moved up. Feeling good. You felt it. Yes. And you knew you could do it. You know you could do it. Yeah. And now you feel more confident. Good. Um, look. Whoa, the band press. It's gonna mess up our squat press because our shoulders are gonna be tired. So when we go back to the Arnold press, be super careful. You're gonna be a little bit fatigued. Watch your form. We still got 30 seconds though before round two. It's weird, it goes fast. It's just gonna be a mental game because we got four more rounds. All right, be ready. Still got 15, or no, I'm sorry, seven second countdown. You guys ready to rock? Rack them, squat, Arnold, press, set, you're up. So I go all the way through the floor with my feet and try to go right into that press. So my lower body, Helps. If you got light weights, you can move really smooth on the rotation and press. Halfway. So good. So good. Amazing, guys. Get a few more. 15 seconds. I'm probably going to hit one more, three, two, one, I'm good. Well, Beautiful. That one felt different. 15 is? Yeah. Oh yeah. I'll give you credit. All right, single leg, slow and controlled, high pull, ready, go for it. Stretch and then pull. When you pull, you want to try to keep your elbow higher than your wrist. So when you get here, on your chest. Keep it kind of quick too. You don't have to fight that dumbbell on the way down. A few more seconds. And switch. Just enough, baby. That one's just enough. The balance is hard. It gets better each round though, watch. Stretch right to the shin. See how I sometimes put my back foot down to catch my balance. We got a few more. Probably gonna get one more. And good, all right. Now how can you possibly breathe when you have a band around your back? Push up, hold. Ready. That was easier on your shoulders, but is it okay? Yeah. If you put it higher? Yeah, totally. Still gives you a little bit, for sure. That was on, we're on. Yeah. And you can step a few and then hit. You never have to do push-ups. I like to mix them in. They make things hard, but use your knees if you need to. Halfway. Good. 
Ah, hard to talk on this one. Keep going. 15 seconds. You got it. Lots of control. I'm getting one more. Time. Beautiful job. We got reverse lunge plus them curls. Both dumbbells if you can. Ready. Go for it. Step back. Curl at the top. This one just keeps you moving. Who said strength isn't cardio? Right? Wow. Halfway. My heart's pounding. Yep. Ripping already. I know. Especially from that hold with that band, you get swept and worn out. Tough. 10 seconds. So if we got it, maybe two more. Uh, maybe one more. Ah, good. Time. All right, jumping jack press. Cardio move to take us into that break. I'm gonna try the band. We say the band is usually harder. It just depends. Nice job. Good job. Well, halfway. Yeah. This one is a mental game. Woo. Long time. Core tight. Save your lower back. Watch your shoulders. Light on your feet. I'm going to try to finish this strong. 10 seconds. Okay. Stop once. Yo. You didn't stop once. Nice push. One minute recovery. Two done. We got three to go. See, it goes quick when you're in, right? Yeah. I think just fewer moves. Yeah. Does mess with you mentally in the sense that it makes it seem easier. Yeah. But then you're kind of like, oh, we're not halfway there yet. You gotta like take one at a time. <laughs> yep. And that first one, I think that's like the hardest to get through. And then you're like, all right, here we go. You got about 20 seconds. All right, third round. We start to feel it even more because those jack presses are gonna make the squat presses challenging. If you like the band, do the band instead. If you need to go to one dumbbell, do one. Here we go. Got to keep the pace moving. It's not my fault. It's the clocks. Five seconds. Rack them and stack them. Ready. And then we go for it. It's like a power move with 30s. That's a 60 pound front load. You got a 30, right? Yep. You got 15. Yeah, my shoulders just fell. I'm going to have to go slow and steady. To make it through this one. Thank goodness we're halfway. Good job, guys. Way to crank them out. 15. I'm gonna try to hit two more, coach. Okay. I'm gonna try to hit one more. Five seconds. Uh, uh, time. That one, when you go down, you can't breathe. It takes so much force to keep your core tight. Hinge, high pull. 
Ready, go. Let's see what happens with two. Stretch, and then go. Stretch, and then go. Good, good, good. Last one. All right, switch sides. How about that? Two makes it a lot harder on the upper body. Don't rush the down. Squeeze your butt to get back up. 10 seconds to go. Probably gonna get two more. We're gonna get one more. And got it. Beautiful. All right, already. Move number three. This one I can't talk, so just get in the zone. You guys get in the zone for one minute. I'll try to tell you halfway, or you'll hear halfway. Taste the life out of you. If you don't have a band, then you probably don't understand, and you think we're crazy. But the band yanks on your core. Halfway, right there. My arms. You got it, coach. My shoulders. <sighs> Trying to get one more. Five seconds. <sighs> Two seconds. Beautiful. <sighs> Thanks for that, guys. Needed it. Reverse lunge with the curls. Ready? Both if you can. Good step back. Good straight up. Control. I rotate the curls at the top. You can go hammer if you want to. Both are great. You feeling it? You got your 15s again. Still. That's right. Doing amazing. Almost to three. Halfway. Yes, I'm breathing loud. In and out, 10, trying to control. If you got the energy, let's get two more. Let's get one more. Three, two, time. Good. All right, I'll try the dumbbell on the jack press cardio to finish it out for round three. I tried the ants, coach. Yeah, pass it out. You might like it. Core tight. Halfway, such a mental game, right? The band, the band shakes you up. 20, you guys are awesome. God, I'm not the only one. Come on. Oh my goodness. 10, seven, five, two, one, got it. I'm glad you went for it. It's different, right? It's very different. The band, definitely harder, because it doesn't let you up. It's like always on you. Yeah. All right, three go. Three go. Okay. Three already. Oh, you can hear me. I can hear you through the camera. 
I know, I know some of you got them heavy weights. It's just hard to get my water. <laughs> Look, it's strength for this cardio. Holy moly. With round four coming up, your shoulders are gonna be more fatigued. We got a lot of presses. Don't be a hero, be smart. If you need one dumbbell, you'd rather go to the band, or maybe you break up the presses. Maybe you do a few squats before you add the press. See how you feel. Oh, I hate this timer. We only got seven seconds. Round number four already though. Take it one move at a time, ready. Wrap them, back them. Here we go. Breathe in if you can, oh my gosh. It's so hard because it takes so much energy to keep them from making you fall over. Heel, heels flat, hips back. Halfway, gotta reset, regroup, get my mind right. I'm trying to get five more of these bad boys. Oh, trying to get four more. Ah. With energy, left, two more. If you got it left, one more. Three, two, one, got it. Oh yeah, hinge, high pull, hinge the high pull. We need the dove step, yo. Go for it. Switch on. You, you like to do the same oh, side? No, no, no. Sorry. I switched legs to start and I forgot to push my arm. So remember, right to the shin, chest up. Squeeze your butt to get back up. Calf muscles starting to fire up. The uh, hinges, because of your nervous system acclimating, they get a little bit easier to hold each round. I didn't have to put my foot down once. Go for it. Chest a little bit higher than you think. Eyes up. I technically should be looking at that camera to see you. Elbow high. Whoops. This one's a little shaky, shaky. Last one. And got it. All right. This darn middle move. Push up, hold. Step out. Add the push up when you can. Ready? And go. Stay strong. When you can, fight back, get into it. Theo. Come on, G. Come on, Angie. Come on, Jan. Come on, Carla and Mike. Anyone else? Let's follow him. Stay strong. Finish it for 10. Nine. I'm trying to get two more. Five. I'm trying to get one more. And time. Yes. Reverse lunge, plus the curl. Might be my favorite move. <laughs> it's a little bit backed off, even though the arms are dead, right? Yeah. We're still at our 15s and 30s. Thanks for pushing, Coach Ash. If you don't drop, I won't drop. Can we make it through the fifth? All right, I did drop on the classes. Oh, that's all right. Just so I could yeah. be strong on the foot. That's right. That's right. I, I prefer that when it comes to shoulders because they're delicate. Halfway. My back is on fire from holding that. 
All right, guys. If you got the juice, we're going two more. If you got the strength, we're going one more. Two, one, good. So I don't know who's going with the band, but you might think we're crazy because it's so hard we stop. But if you've got one, you'll know why. It's ridiculous if you do these presses with the band. Your pitch, cardio it out, and then we rest. I'm close. You're doing amazing. Woo! You haven't stopped and we're halfway. Reset. Woo! Regroup. And let's go. Gotta get in there. Okay. Let's go. Pop. Oh. You can do it. Three, two. Wow. Oh, I'm impressed. I'm impressed. You guys that aren't stopping are amazing. Great news. Four done. Look how fast it goes. Four done. One more round to finish out the big five for five. Get that recovery. Hey, one move at a time. Five minutes of work. That's right. Anyone that's got light weights is laughing at us right now. They're like, why are they so tired? This girl's using 12 and 15s, 30s. Some of you got 15s and 20s. Whew. And then remember, lightweights, you just move fast. You're still getting it. Oh, gosh, this darn clock. I was trying to stall us, but I can't because the clock is the leader right now. Five seconds till round five. Rack them, stack them, be careful. Please watch your shoulders. Good technique, watch your back, squat. And go, hips back, feet flat. Every rep counts. So much energy being used right now. Thank goodness, ah, thank goodness we're halfway. I'm gonna try to get five more. You guys keep it up. I'm gonna try to get two more. Eight oh. seconds. One more. Three seconds. And got it. One down. Four to go with the HD Shred Big Five workout. Ready. Go for it. Lots of control. More seconds. Let's say for sure. One more. And good. Switch. This one's a good one. You just gotta control it. Ooh, got the rhythm. This one's feeling good. Ah. Ten seconds. Probably one more for sure right here. And got it, good. All right. The worst move that I wish I didn't prescribe, but because I hate it, I know I gotta do it. Here we go. For the last time. That's right. 
That's right. We're on. We can do it. Receive so long. Fifteen. I gotta get two more. <laughs> Five. I gotta get one more. Uh, three. Right. Two. One. So glad. That's over with. All right. Reverse lunge, guys. Move four. We got two left. Doing amazing. This is the recovery one. Said no one ever. Who said you can't get in the best shape of your life? With dumbbells, bands, body weight. Five moves. 35 minutes. I mean, that could be it. You could stop right after this. Halfway. And that's all you need. Good job, guys. Control your form. Get in the zone. Be present on the moment. Every rep, make it good. 10 seconds. If you got the energy, two more. If you've got it in you, one more. Got it. Oh, round or move five. I'm gonna start with the band. And then I'm gonna finish with that dumbbell. Let's keep it moving for the whole minute. And then we're done. Ready, set, hit it. Finally, halfway. All right, regrouping. Core tight. Here we go. You got it, guys. 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7. Six, five, four, three, two, one, time. Woo! Wow. Good job. Oh, deceiving, deceiving. No lie, that hurt to get my arm up there. <laughs> Can't get it up. Oh. But you guys are in better shape than me, so you probably didn't feel it. All right. You thinking abs? I'm feeling abs, and then anyone who wants to do a bonus can mile Perfect. it up after. Perfect. I love it. Because look at that. 45 minutes in, we'll do 10 minutes of abs. We'll pick three moves. We'll do three times. I love hitting these ab moves, too. Yeah. And then, like she said, We'll shut off the camera, and then if you want to, you got it, you go for a mild cool down. All right, guys. Let's take it to the floor. We'll go. V-ups, heels to heaven, bicycles. You know the moves. I'll remind you. And one of them, we'll do a little bit extra since you're getting so strong. Um, with those V-ups, you can totally keep your feet on the ground. You can bend them or you can keep them straight. I like to touch, hit my shins, and then I'm back. Big stretch. Let's go for 12. Are you ready? Set and go. All the way up. 
all the way up. So by isolating the legs and never letting them drop, it makes so much control. I think I got two more. One more. Good rest. Now these heels to heaven, we're gonna do 16. So get stronger. Hands under your butt, easier. Fingertips behind your head, protects your neck. A little bit harder. Knees bent if you need to, legs straight if you can. Butt off the ground, then stick it halfway. Go, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, what did I say, 16, yeah. 13, Ooh. 14, 15, 16, oh. four extra makes a difference, slow your breathing down, we got bicycles next, hey you know the tip I thought of the other day, to try to get people to do this right, because you know what they do, they bend their arms and they're like this. Yeah. So keep one on the ground when you turn. See how it's glued to the ground? Mm -hmm. And then I twist, and the other one glues to the ground, and then you twist. Oh, yeah. That's gonna make you feel it, and it's gonna keep your elbows and shoulders back. Watch what happens. Ready? 90 degree bend in your knees. They don't move, just your upper body. Glue one elbow down, twist with the other one. Go, one, back, two, back, three, Back, four, back, five, back, six, good, seven, good, eight, good, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. You see what I mean? Yeah, definitely. Comes it more in my obliques. Yeah. The little strategies. I am getting better at those. I thought someone froze on there. Looks like they're still in it. I know. You get better. That's a sweet. Okay, round two. V ups. All right, let's get through them. You ready? Yep. Be a little bit fatigued here. Set. And go all the way back and up. Twelve's the number. Two more. One more. And good. You get stronger at those? Yeah. Yeah. Everything. That's awesome. I love it. Repetition is clutch. Sometimes people don't want to do it because it's boring, but man, it's how you get stronger, it's how you get results. All right, heels to heaven. We'll get right into it. 16. Ready? All the way up. Go. Then stick. If you got lower back issues, you need your knees bent. As long as you push your butt up, you're getting that core in there. Eight. Yeah, don't lose count on me. I got you. You know, we'll end up doing more than we want. That was 12. 12. 13. How many are we doing? 16. <laughs> Woo! Is that 16? Yep. Oh. I took the hands off my head and, uh, a lot more control. All right, these bicycles, round two, 20 reps. Gonna feel it. Let's get right into it. Mental game, set. 90 degree bend, elbows pinned back. Go, one, back. It's subtle, too. It's not like you have to get all the way to your knee, not at all. 
It's like mind blown. Just enough. And then I got it. That little push. Back. 10. 12. Oh. Last one. Those. Those. Got rough. I love it. All right, two rounds. Love this, man. So much work, such little time. We're going to do one more round? Let's do one more round. I think we can do it. Yeah. Three is like the game changer, too, when it comes to these. We didn't do the plank variation today, but that's okay. I wanted to get these three in. I might do the bonus one because I want you to see the new variation. So maybe we'll do that for the bonus after this round. All right. I say let's just knock them out. As clean as you can. V up. Ready. Set it. Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One more. Ah, oh, yes. Yes. All right. So anyone that wants to level up on these heels to heaven, I put my hands to the side, and I try to go, and then it takes so much control. If you want to try a few, maybe you do the all 16. I don't know. I dare you. Ready? Set. And, gosh, my shirt is so stuck to me. Go for it. One. Two. This is like a thick hoodie, too. This is not a good one to wear today. Six, right? in the best shape of our life. No lie, I'm dead serious. I feel better than I've ever done. These workouts have been so challenging. And talk about fitness motor, which is my favorite thing in fitness, is having a motor. Some people can go fast. Some people are super strong. Not a lot of people can just keep going, though. That's how we train at FMU. Let's do our bicycle. Ready? And go you know, one. These are going to be terrible. Two, three, but amazing. Four, five, six. Remember, elbows back. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Not bad. Seventeen. Three more. Two more. One more. Perfect. And then I'll show you that bonus move. And we'll do it for fun. Just be really careful because sometimes your mat, you're slippery because you're sweaty. We're going to hold a plank with one arm. So we're going to go like this. Hold a plank, right? Reach under. Don't move your toes and just look up. So you're not turning your body sideways. You're going to try to stay square, fight the rotation, and then come back under. And then We'll switch halfway. Stay strong. Ready? Starting on my left arm. If you need your knees, use them. Go. Rotate and look. Plank. I mean, you, your body will turn a tiny bit, but we're not trying to turn into a side plank. That's right, man. Some feet stay planted. Yeah. Wide base. You're really trying to fight the rotation. Then come back to center. That was good. That's halfway. Rest for a second. If you can feel your quads start to get tired too. And then we'll reset. Other side, ready? Set. Go. It's about eight reps. Two. 
Two more. One more. And good. You like it? Ooh, I like it. It's a good one. Hard to breathe on that one too. Yeah. Hey, look. Awesome workout. Good job. You guys at home, amazing job. So, Coach Andy's challenge. You go for a mile jog to cool it down. When we shut this camera off, drink lots of water. And we'll see you guys on Thursday. Good job, Jen. Good job, G. Good job, Quinn. You guys rock. Appreciate you guys. Thank you for always jumping in.